Yeah, it definitely must be a Monday thing, because I do not feel the same. Even though I'm still tired, but I'm waiting for the caffeine to kick in. So, a funny thing I noticed was, I haven't drunk, drank a uh, Rockstar energy drink for a couple weeks now. Um, I was, like, kind of dependent on them, which I think was really mentally, for the last... Uh, few years actually so anyway I'm kind of playing this game I always try to play this game at least once a day it's a it's a nice idle RPG you don't have to be active to play it but uh, anyway little game that I play called animal restaurant and uh, I just like log in once or twice a day and click my tips once you get enough staff hired, they'll take the orders and clean up, like that little cat with the broom is cleaning up. But when you log into the game, you can sit there and uh, do it yourself. But they give you a lot, of, a lot of opportunity to earn COD, which is the money in the game. Uh, but I just don't do it, because I, sometimes I don't feel like watching ads. And uh, it's not really a race, it's just more for fun, so... But, uh, you know, it builds up, it progresses. You know, like this little thing in the middle there with the exclamation mark is an ad. I don't feel like watching an ad right now. And, to be honest with you, I don't even really read the whole game because it's just slow progression. And what I'll do is collect the COD some days and that's it, the tips, I should say. And then I might upgrade, uh, usually all. I don't think I have enough money to give anyone raises. This task thing, it's, I think it's a bug. It's always lit when I first log in, but there's nothing to collect. So the promote thing at the bottom, I don't feel like watching an ad. So that's just another um, thing there. So, oh man, I clicked on that by accident. Okay, I won't bore you with it. Ooh, that, what the heck? Dude. What are you exposing me to? So today's goal is to use up the rest of this pen. The ink in this pen. So, um, I don't know. It must be a Monday thing because I do not feel like I did yesterday. Which is good. Here is the Ozark Trail model 8607 pound pound with the scales removed. And uh, you can see where it's polished on the blade side. And I don't know the terminology, but not polished or whatever on that side. Or It looks kind of cool, though. It looks like a stone wash on the tank. But there it is in all its glory. as compared to the model 8607 pound with the painted tang. Uh, this is the one I'm currently using. Um, kind of ground down that to see if I can get the edge sharper for uh, fire steel. But anyway, I have not seen these at Walmart now, so There you go. To experiment, so this ginger ale, I'm going to add some of this sun kissed orange peach mango to see if it'll make it taste better. I mean, ginger ale's okay, but. Anyway, I have a bad habit, though, when I do this. Usually it's the two liters full. and Because it, it does that. But uh, I drank enough of it that I hope it doesn't overflow. So. What the heck? What the heck? Oh, shoot. Note to self. Never underestimate the power of chemical reaction. But it does taste better.
Should I be concerned about this green? This is the second one that's had green on it. I mean, the first one didn't kill me, but I wonder what it is. I don't think it's mold. Oh, almost there. Oh, I'm losing all my hair. No, I'm not really. Look at that. These gel pens, they're fun to use, but they run out of ink quick. But I really don't like ballpoint pens anymore. That being said, I've got to take some pain meds. I have a sciatic nerve, and uh, or sci sciatica, I guess is what it's called. So, and to be honest with you, these just kind of take the edge off. They don't really help with the pain, but that's okay. Gonna be, this is gonna be my new project stick, my therapy stick. I'm gonna carve it, but I'm not sure what I'm gonna make out of it. So, tonight we're gonna light this uh, flare up, and uh, I'm gonna try to, well, I'm gonna save this plastic piece. Last time I didn't save it, but it's got the uh, striker tip there, a little sticker that you can strike. And I think it should work with matches, but I'm going to put them in my emergency kits. And this whole plastic piece pops off. And there's a, a black little, like, button. It's not really a button you push, but like a giant match that you strike it against. So I thought that might be kind of handy to have another place to strike matches if you don't have strike anywhere matches. But uh, I think the last time I didn't run for 15 minutes because it, like, burned itself like I stick it basically in a fire. So anyway, this will be fun. I have to get these for Fourth of July if they last fifteen minutes. They're just like giant lights. Yummy. And finally, we are out of ink. So. There you go. That was fun. Working on this red one now. Gel ink still. I don't know if you can see how much ink there is. One hour left till I can play outside for a bit. Oh, I'm going to have to go play outside today. 52 degrees for a high, and I have seen no rain. So this firewood uh, that I got at Dillon's is softer than the one I got at Walmart. And it may just be this particular piece, but my knife is really cutting it well. So... Yeah, the other one's really hard wood, but this one is pretty soft, so makes it fun to cut, carve, whatever. Doo -doo -doo.
you see the saw on the back of that Camelus Carnivore X, look what it's doing to my baton. So. You can't tell with the camera, but it's getting dark and I'm going to head inside. I got 56 subscribers now. Hmm, interesting. So, here's, here's a recipe that I learned to make a, a bowl of pizza. Pop this bad boy in the microwave. And there's the final product. Pizza soup. Old recipe. Old family recipe.